All right, welcome back to Kevin Solitude. Uh, we hadn't gotten a video out in a couple weeks. Uh, we was going to go Sunday and uh, start a whole new project. We've uh, picked us up an Alaskan chainsaw mill. What we got set up here. Got my old chainsaw put on it. We have a bunch of logs that are slaying on the ground from where trees have fallen and we've just cut them up enough to get them out of the way so the plan is to start putting them logs to use I don't have a whole lot of ways to move logs around so the, this seemed like the perfect solution for me I'm able to you know, just go right out to where they're at set them up, cut them up and I can haul out the planks by hand but I can't carry a log by hand <laughs> So this way we can start getting us some lumber together because we've got some projects we want to build. And uh, with pro so lumber being the way it is, it's, it's just not feasible for me anyways. So I'm going to just start stocking me up some lumber myself. I don't know how long it's going to take me to do. You know, I, I, I watched uh, one of the other YouTube videos with uh, Ringworm and he's, he's built a whole whole place out by himself using his chainsaw so it's pretty interesting to watch first time I ever seen one of these used was uh, on my self-reliance Sean James did some work with one one day and I thought well you know that's a really neat idea and then I started watching ringworm and he's done a lot of stuff with it and I mean he's out there constantly cutting up logs with a, a chainsaw and building lumber you know so I thought you know, if these guys can do it, I can do it too. I may not be as fast as they are. I may not be as efficient as they are, but I've got time. I just, you know, I can go out there, and when I'm out there and I see a log, I can start working on it, and I'll just start stockpiling it up until I got enough to start building some projects that I want to get done. One of them being, I I want to do a, a combination outhouse shower building, and uh. I've decided I'm going to go compost toilet on it. That way I don't have to worry about moving the whole building once the pit fills up. And uh, that's where we're at. Right now we're hoping to get out there this Sunday. It's that one day I can get my son that he's got off and he can go with me to help me get stuff set up or move a log a little. At least get it positioned. But uh, last weekend we were going to go on Sunday and we got rained out. And obviously you don't want to be out trying to, you know, sawmill lumber in the rain. I mean, you could, but it'd be messy. And that's where we're at right now. We're going to have Liam, my son, and myself hopefully on Sunday going out. So we'll keep you updated as we go. I'm sorry it's been a while between videos. Um, if you like what we're doing or are interested in what we're trying to get done, uh, subscribe, hit the like button. And you'll keep updated on where we're at. I'm trying to put out a video every two weeks, but you know, with weather being as it is, it's I'm, it is mercy right now. So once summer hits, we'll be able to get a lot more done. We get a lot of rain here in West Virginia. I mean, you don't even have to worry about watering something because it's going to get watered by the rain anyway. So it's, it's my biggest deciding factor on what we're able to get done. But uh, thank you for watching. Uh, Stay with us, and we'll start getting some projects going. Thanks for thanks for viewing in.